What's up, everybody? Jason here for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Happy new release day, guys. This time, 2022 Bowman Chrome Baseball HGA Choice released today on this Friday. Now, this is a 12-box case break. Pikachu is number one. And again, still Bowman Chrome. Still got some autos, but all you're getting is autos. Just three autographs per box. No base cards, no numbered cards. Just straight up three autos per box. So this is kind of just skipping all that. That pack ripping, pack stacking, and just going one pack, three autos. I wish they kind of made Bowman Baseball this way. And like Topps Chrome, that would be actually pretty cool. Maybe they will eventually, but... I know they did this a few years back with HTA Choice, and a really good idea. Alright, so should have uh, 12 boxes there. Empty box. I think they still come in those little slider boxes, so... We'll be collecting a lot of those. But, let's see how this goes, guys. So, actually, what I'm probably going to do... Is kind of just stack these up. And then... We'll just rip them one by one. I think it'll be a little bit more faster this way. I'm doing it myself, Mike Tower. Anybody, uh, anybody go Black Friday shopping, actually? Like, still physically at a store, mall? Or did everybody just, uh, lay in bed today and just do it on the comforts of their phone? I feel like my sister, she's been working retail pretty much her whole life. She was saying that this year a lot of retail stores were anticipating a much better Black Friday. My sister is a manager of uh, Athleta. I bought something for Black Friday. Something typical. TV. My bedroom TV that I've had for a couple years is just kind of slow now, so an excuse to just buy a new one. Does grocery stores have Black Friday deals too? Like, are, are like the onions on sale? Yeah, if you go to a, if you go to a store like that, kind of like a Target, or Walmart, where they sell more than just groceries. But I, but what about like yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I wonder like if grocery stores that are just straight up groceries, do they have any Black Friday sales? You have to think so, right? All right, here we go, guys. So. We'll do one box at a time like normal, but I just wanted to rip them all. And we'll see what kind of stuff we hit here, guys. Good luck. All right, first one is a Jason Shurio. All right, so Cleveland on the board. And Cleveland, sorry, I don't even think I showed you guys the list. So, if you have a character sign, that means you got that from a team random. The rest bought those straight up. And there's everybody there.
We have a CJ Rodriguez for the Oakland A's. And then Victor Labrada. I know, right? That's what I'm saying. Maybe not like the common stuff. Maybe like, uh, you know, that, that really good filet mignon steak is like, you know, Black Friday deal or something, you know. I don't know. It's just a thought. <laughs> I actually want to see if like video games this weekend are on sale. I figure they are, right? I just recently got a PlayStation 5 finally, so if I can get some discount on some games, definitely want to purchase that. Alright, first one here in the second box is Estelani Lani uh, Castillo. A little color match there for the Tampa Bay Rays. Timothy with that one. We have Michael Garcia. That is very true, yeah. Especially the day after. And wow, look at that. Jackson Shurio to 50. That is a gold shimmer, and that is 38 of 50. Who has the Milwaukee Braves? Or Braves, sorry, Milwaukee Braves. Milwaukee Brewers, I meant to say, sorry. Uh, Matthew Strope. There you go. That is a very, very nice one right there. He's one of the top prospects. This dude is still just 18 years old. Out of Venezuela. Rated as number 30 prospect in his international signing class by MLB.com. But uh, a lot of upside with this kid. There you go. Very, very nice. Actually, I'm keeping this box. That's what I'm using it for. Yeah, I get my ham at Costco, Mike. Mike Tower, the ham at Costco is just very good for the price. Alright, next one is a Danny D. Andre. To 150 blue for the Minnesota Twins. Wow, this is a great color box. Blue. Braxton full four. Little Ray Wave. To 150. That's for the Rockies and Sean Maddock. And then we got a. Thomas Farr, which, you know what? This 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 year's Bowman Chrome has a, not that many pitchers, which is great. I feel like a lot of people hate the pitchers, but that's a nice gold right there. Okay, okay, okay. So almost halfway through the first one. First half, I should say. So far, some pretty big bangers. Refractor there for the Red Sox, Rafaela. Aaron Miller. We have a Michael Hernandez. Orioles, that is David. And Mason Hauer. TB. That's going to Timothy. Jackson Merrill, which of course is a nice one as well. That's to four ninety nine Padres, just as uh, Kajan says, go Padres. There you go. We have Junior Perez, Ace Fred, and then for the Yankees, that is Benjamin Cowles.
Alright, last box here, and then we have the second half of the case still to go. So it looks like all in all it might take me about 20 minutes tops to do this break. I'm at the 10 minute mark and we're about halfway there, so. Wow, Christian Vaquero to 150. Wow, is HGA Choice just so much more loaded? Man, we barely get like one of these guys in a case of hobby. For the Nationals, that's going to EA. Good Lord. Juan Guerrero? Or did I just pick a very good case? Either one. Colorado Rockies, that's going to Sean Maddock. And then we got a Esteban Machado. All right, let's go to the second half of the case. First of Ian Lewis Green for the Marlins. Going to Kyle. We have Willie Vasquez for TV. And I uncovered it already, but we got a green atomic of Michael Garcia tonight or not for Kansas City. Sean Maddock with that one. Uh, GOAT collectibles. It's just, it's still a 12 box case break for number 10. It's just that, uh, those teams didn't sell straight up. So we put all those teams together and, uh, basically divided it by X amount, whatever teams are remaining. So that to break is a 14 spot break. So we're charging 109. We're giving you $50 a spot, but uh, it's a 12 box case. It's just, those are the leftover teams that nobody bought. So, uh, you would get that team in a 12 box case. And it looks like Nick also put up another team random for four and five. So, I'm going to run back some more HTA we can. All right, we got Luis Gill, or Gill. Yankees, that's going to Matt Smith. So, it seems like some boxes have a sh ton of color. And some boxes will have all base, full Ford. But all in all, in the whole case, it seems like it's been pretty solid so far. TV, a Stanley, Castillo. All right, four more to go. All right, we have Edison Paulino for Boston. Aaron Miller with that one. We have a Tanner McDougal. That's for the White Sox going to Eric Leal. And Antonio Pinero from Milwaukee. Matthew S. with that one. <clears throat> All right, Speckle of Mason for TB to 299. Speckles always look really nice. Andy Thomas for the Mariners. Mariners is Chad Cromwell. And a Ian Lewis for the Marlins. Yeah, 
All right, two more to go, guys. Two more boxes to go. So we got some green coming up. And we got Christian Franklin to 99, Green Atomic. We have a Braxton Full Four for the Colorado Rockies, Sean Maddock to 4.99, and Ricardo Cabrera Reds going to Matthew Linder. All right, guys, last box here, folks. Good luck. Purple. Gavin Stone for the Dodgers. Dodgers, that's going to mark. We have for the Red Sox. McLevany. It's Aaron Miller. And last one here, Gerard Gonzalez, Kansas City, Sean Maddox. All right, guys, and just like that, there you go. That was pick your team number one. So, quick little recap. A lot of heat early on. But all in all, still some nice stuff. So, quick little recap there. Boom. All right, green atomic there. Paulino Refractor, Morris Lucia, Ian Lewis. Big hit right there for the Nationals. Got Ghetto to 150 blue. Jackson Merrill was a really nice one as well. And then Full Ford, Andrade. And then how about a little Jackson to 50 Shimmer Gold, which is a big one. We got Jason. They're not related, are they? Wait, actually, are they related? Oh, wow, yes, they are related. So there you go. His older brother, Jackson. So this guy's actually two, from born in 2005. How was that happening, man? 2005? Good Lord. This guy is a baby. So this guy just turned 18. This guy's still 17 years old. Good Lord. There you go. I think those are the two biggest ones there, man. So appreciate it, folks. That was number one. Number two, coming up next.